Well, hey, more of that to come in this heat right here. The Hawaiian Pro rolls on round three, heat 12, Ethan Ewing. He has got a huge task in front of him. Jackson Andre, David Silva, Michael Rodriguez, raging on the beach right now too, you can hear it. And to start us off, it's gonna be Michael Rodriguez. And you know that Rodriguez got behind him. Joel Parkinson, McFanning. And here he goes, Ethan Ewing. Qualified, seeming, seemingly qualified for the championship tour relatively easily. I mean, he kind of led the whole way. He was your Vans Triple Crown of Surfing Rookie of the Year. You were such a great surfer. You can see him gliding in here. Timing perfect, style. Nice rail turn back into the corner. A little hung up there. And then finishes quick and easy off the end of that section. So, you know, Ethan Ewing is a world junior champion. This kid has got so much talent. It's crazy. It's just a headspace thing for him to get it together. And, you know, guys like Joel Parkinson and Mick Fanning are giving him that support that he needs right now. And it's great to see because this kid is, is a red-hot surfer. With QS. 13 heat wins this year. And here we go. Straight back at it. Ethan Ewing showing his hunger. Little slice. Vertical snap. Straight into that end bowl section goes down. Ewing could run away with this thing real quick. It's true. And then again, all the flags, sponsorship stickers, friendships, they just go out the window when you put the jersey on and head out in the lineup. Well, let's just put it out there. The Brazilians are passionate and they don't want to go down to each other. Michael Rodriguez can't get around that section. Good job, and uh, but uh, everything changed right now. It's like it's, it's crazy because uh, I almost finished my career and never got in the old tour. Now I have opportunity to, to new begins and be next year a full season in the tour. I'm sure they're incredibly proud of you. You're still going to carry on your campaign yet at the Hawaii. And he almost had to get a job, but now he's got the best job in the world. Championship tour surfer. Congratulations again to William Cardoso. Wow, Rodriguez on the replay. Just a couple of sweeps into the corner. Great surfing, fast, quick, lightning, just snap corners. I love it. <laughs> the window's yep. closing. Look at this guy. Oh, another surfer that needs these points, needs a big finish here and at Sunset Beach. He's done it before. We watched him last year. I mean, basically needing, I think those. I mean, this guy is the most liked guy on the world tour, I must say. Jadson Andre is fired up, his passion. His surfing ability, everything is on, a, it's like on 12 right now. All he wants to do is take this thing to the next level. Get back to the drawing board. A big finish of pipe, and here we go. Yeah, there's a priority play right there. David Silva had priority. And fighting a tough wave to surf. Dill, check out this positioning thing here. We got... Get Rodriguez having to back off because Silva had priority. Silva does a little slambo on the inside to finish. No and, interference there. Well, you got to be careful there because if, and ride the same way, but they cannot hinder the performance. Whoa, Jackson Andre. Straight up into the lip. Oh, right on a dry reef. That is. There's a replay. Sketch. So, Jaddy, cool. baby, he was well overhead wave, Bam. bumpy, just throws it up into it. Jadson was charging over in Portugal. Look at that lumpy road through, held composure on the rail, then comes up a little bit late to the party through the roof, and then comes down with the white water kind of exploding around him. He made that look way easier than it was. So was there And do any kind of body movement, and he would have gotten interference. You play it he up a little bit. Yeah, yeah. he could have played it up. It would be like a flop in, so in football or soccer. Viewing up and down, so, I mean, that was close enough to uh, freak Rodriguez out a little bit. He's got to be careful here. Off the bottom, bam! Carving jam straight up into the foam climb. Man, this guy surfs good. Good night. <laughs> that was insane. <laughs> With a wave like that, I mean, drops in. Look at this double up he's got. He's got a sick little zone. Big hack on the open face, just water everywhere. This is kind of a transfer to get through the section, and then finds the closeout, bang! 
straight over the toilet bowl, comes down with authority. Michael Rodriguez, look at this drive and speed into this first turn. Big, huge layback jam. Just holding the rail, everything, power pocket. And he's eyeballing down the line, gets that foam climb. And then he's looking for more. So he comes into the finish right here, slams it, perfect timing, as it just shuts down over that toilet bowl, pushes down hard. Look at that, literally inches deep where he came down right there. That was about as good as you could have surfed that wave. Right was behind it, Ethan Ewing. Yeah, that was the prior yeah. wave that we saw of Ethan Ewing trying to like do something, but put the points up on the board here. Let's take a look at the replay. Bottom turn, looking for the lip line, finds a quick little snap, buckets, another quick little one, and then whoa, finds the finish. So got three off, bang, bang, bang. You know, this is just... Slambo, look at that, perfect timing in the lip with water flying, Christmas trees. That one's kind of just a setup snap, but this finish, Pretty strong. A little uh, backwash kind of threw him off, but he played right through that. Real precise. All those three of those turns, not easy to do. Three turns in that small of a space, and this guy's been relatively obsolete in this heat. David Silva. Yes. Yeah. That's an Andre's last wave. He jumps into second place. Here goes David Silva. Straight into the lip on a rare left, but only a one-turn wonder. Tor, you're going to find yourself right there for the world title. Jadson Andre cutting left. Goes to the air. The trademark. Air 360 from Jadson Andre. Goes to the layback. Tries to get back up on his stomach. Goes down. <laughs> into play. And Watch this. Into the wind. So the wind's pressing against his board. Just pushes it right around. That was crazy. And then slips it up into the whitewater zone right there. A little over does it. You get a good look at it right here. He just releases the weight, gets the board, bends high, flying around, nose picks in, finishes up the rotation on the water. One of few, very few airs we've seen today. Control and command in this heat. Here's how Ooh, he's done check it. This out. Yeah, check this out. Man, what that guy said. Huge gouge. Fitting song, let me tell you. As he comes to the inside and just connection section. Supplack! Flies out over that toilet bowl. Right over that shallow water. You can just see the reef trying to poke through the bottom. And then Jadson Andre finds himself a three-turn combo. Laser sharp. Last turn, solid. Comes in right there. That was a decisive Seven, wave four, right three, there. and then this, the five, four, three to seal it up. The second place. Flicks it into that wind and flies around. Think he's having fun? Yeah, it's an Andre. I think that always, was an air that kind of shocked the judges. Always. Definitely not out of the question. Now Jadson's feeling these laps, running against the current, winding up back into the air. Now that would have been a huge air for Jadson. Now it's it's a big deal to me. Here we go, live action. WSLTitleRace.com That's where you get the inside scoop. Michael Rodriguez with the inside reward. Two turns down the line. And here goes Ethan Ewing trying to fight back. Nice opening slice. Off the bottom, straight to the lip. Fits in a third. Ethan Ewing needing a five. See the replays. Uh, here goes Rodriguez sitting out front very comfortably over that 14 mark. Well, you growled when you said his name. I love this guy. He's got a growl in him. Me too. I'm, he, a, I'm, I'm a Mike Rodriguez here's the, fan. here's the wave I think is gonna do it for him. Look, he got a lot of speed and flow. Big snap right there. Comes around the corner, slams it into the lip again, and then finishes on the inside. There wasn't really a whole lot. I, there, you know what? You he might, didn't make it easy for the judges. He's not making it easy because there wasn't a lot of crazy maneuvers. And here comes Jaddy. Trying to fend him off. Goes beyond vertical. Jadson wow. Andre straight into the white water again. Just hanging on with his toes. And he goes, what? Yeah. All on the championship tour. I think the speed kind of confused me. But look at this. This replay, a little setup. And then watch this vert slam. Bam! That is just vertical. It's 12 o'clock. So I think what the judges are going to like about Ethan Ewing's wave, it was really fast and very explosive as he went down the line. Yeah. So he had that going for him. 
but do you, you, you separate that? Oh, he's back up. Oh, live action. Oh, and he's down. Or we'll see. Here's another look at Ethan Ewing's last wave. Nice read on it. Comes across it. Big slam, but then comes undone right there. Wow, so Ethan's previous wave puts him in second. We're still waiting on Just that Jackson like Andre wave, though. A couple points, so 6.07. Ethan Ewing now in second place, but you're right. Now, Jadson Andre is looking for a 5 6 4. Well, a stunning turn of events in the final seconds of that beat. Jadson Andre, safe again. We got so much more surfing to come. Do not go anywhere. The Hawaiian Pro rolls on. Pete Mellon, Kaipo Guerrero, joining us in the booth.